We believe a great mentor is empathic and respectful. Has integrity and is kind. Inspiring and supportive. My name is Paolo Morande. I am a researcher from the Tumor Stroma Interactions Group, led by Drs. Etienne Musset and Jerome Paghetti at the Luxembourg Institute of Health. And I am also a researcher from the National Scientific System of Argentina in South America. I am very happy that I was nominated by my colleagues to receive the FNR Award for Outstanding Mentor. Doing your PhD can be really hard. You work a lot to get results and then experiments fail and you get frustrated. So with Pablo, you can talk freely about uh, science and it's always a fruitful discussion. In general, you can talk with him about anything and also about emotional and social aspects. I think we all joined the scientific community wanting to change the world, uh, but inevitably at the end we end up focusing exclusively on our own research. And uh, Pablo always encourages us to take a step back and reminds us that we can change the world by pursuing our passion. Parfois, j'ai des questions que je n'ose pas poser parce que j'ai peur d'être uh, stupide, mais avec Pablo, ce n'est pas le cas. Il est toujours là pour m'aider. C'est vraiment quelqu'un de gentil, serviable et toujours disponible. I think a PhD is one of the most challenging moments in a scientist's life, and also psychologically, which is often overlooked in our field. But it can really hinder the progress of your research or your life quality, for that matter. Pablo's support deeply empowered me as a person and as a scientist, and it helped me get to where I am today. I was very happily surprised when I knew that my colleagues had nominated me. I was not expecting it at all. When I arrived here, I guess I just did my best to try to adapt to this big group and to keep a friendly and collaborating atmosphere. I never considered these exchanges as one-way processes. For me, these are double-sided exchanges where we all learn. It makes me happy that my presence is positive for other members of the group. Apparently this award is showing that. This is my first time working for a long period outside South America. So I had a lot of doubts about how I would adapt to a new environment and culture. But fortunately, my colleagues here at the TSI group make my everyday a great and learning experience. I am very grateful for my former mentor and few other people along my career who have impacted me on how I conceive mentorship processes. Uh, they definitely were fundamental for how now I discuss about uh, well-being or social aspects or scientific aspects with my colleagues here in Luxembourg. I think science should not only be about producing scientific output like publishing or chasing a possible patent. From my point of view, we have to try to discuss and update permanently our roles as researchers in the society with the different actors outside the academic community. We need to interact always trying not to lose the focus in that our goals must be directed to the real needs of the society as a whole. At least this is how I conceive my working activity and what I try to pursue.